Hey guys, it's me Ona. Today we are going to be doing a full face of 99 cent store makeup. I really have high hopes for this video. I'm really hoping that they just like hit, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to be honest with you guys and let you know if anything's a hit or a miss, okay? Why do I always do that when I make YouTube videos? I'm always like, okay, like girl, okay. Anyway, so I just went ahead and used my own Neutrogena Mo Moisturizer because they didn't really have a moisturizer or a primer there. So we're just going to go ahead and start off with our first item. First things first, Ioni. If you know Ioni, you know that they have a lot of good lashes, okay? And only for 99 cents. Girl, I'm going to stop saying okay. Somebody do a counter check of how many times I say okay in this video. Anyways, this is she. Since I start off with my brows, we're going to do our brows first. This is the medium brown Ioni brow pencil. Okay, says she's... <laughs> says she's waterproof, natural brow, perfect arch. Is she really waterproof though? She's cute. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm going to start off with doing my brow gel. So this is the same brand, Ioni. A clear brow gel, clear and lightweight, sets and holds all day. They had some in like brown too, but I just wanted to try out the brow pencil. Do we like the Christmas vibes? Can I get a round of applause, please? I got my little handy dandy mirror so I could see up close and personal. So she's a nice little wand. So right off the bat, first impression, it kind of doesn't feel gel-like, like where you want it glued to your face. It doesn't really give me that vibe. I don't know if it would stay all day. I don't want to like down talk it and then it actually works. But I mean, she like placed the brows, but I don't know if I'd say this would set them all day. I'm very lenient when it comes to brow gels, but I don't know. What I usually would do next in my normal makeup routine would be to carve out my eyebrows with the concealer and then fill them in and then conceal them again. But just for the sake of this video, I don't want to try out the concealer yet. I want to wait till we get to our foundation and stuff. So I'm just going to go ahead and try out the brow pencil. So my brows look a little crazy, but once I conceal, I feel like it'll be good. I don't know, maybe if it's just not a good pair to do with the brow gel, cause like my brow gel is still kind of wet. I'm gonna try this eyebrow. This just may not be my color. It says medium brown. I feel like it's a good brow pencil. I would get this. I would get this. I mean, I got it. Maybe just let the brow gel sit a little longer or don't use the brow gel at first and then do the brow gel. I just usually do it that way, so that's what I did. Let's just go ahead and try to conceal these bad boys. So here we have their full coverage concealer. Let's see how full coverage she is. This is by Pearl World and it's in the shade Toffee. Sorry, I have you guys close up and personal. I just want you guys to really see the effect. Okay, let's try her out. I have high hopes, you guys, I really do. I just hope this is my shade. Oh my God, I'm scared. Okay, shade match is not too far off. Okay, girl, stop with the okay. Oh my goodness. I'm not mad at all. I'm not mad. If anything, if they had like a shade, maybe one lighter, it would be perfect. The real test is gonna be seeing how it does on like my red areas, my bags. We'll get there. It helped our brow situation though. So I'm not mad. Okay, period. Girl, I'm done. Ah! <laughs> Let's do this other eyebrow and then we'll get into the skin. This is the finished look with brows. And I actually like them. We made it work, you guys. And I think that the brow gel like set a little bit more within time. So it's actually pretty good. I also think that this brow pencil may be waxed. So maybe that's what helps set it as well. Let's get into the rest of this face. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and put concealer under my eyes and just in my problem areas, and then we're gonna work on foundation. So I'm using the same one, the high coverage one in Toffee. I'm really gonna put it on there, so hopefully like gives us full coverage. Lord knows I need it for my eye bags. Putting it around my nose. I would take my nose piercings out, y'all, but I just pushed these babies back in their holes and they're not coming out. I'm sorry. I'm not gonna let it sit too long because I don't want it to get too dry. <laughs> 
Let's hope. This is the Total Control Drop Foundation in the shade Warm Honey. It says buildable coverage, natural finish, and lightweight formula. Honey boo boo cha. Ah! Bitch. Okay. Cute. I like her. No shade, but like. When I press the top, nothing comes out, and I sucked it up. So we're just gonna go like this. First impressions. Okay, I'm gonna be honest. It kind of feels like paint. Okay, let's hope she does her job. Dude, this looks lighter than my concealer. I'm gonna um, try to blend out my concealer real quick before it dries too fast. I'm gonna put some setting spray. No, this is just my own setting spray, okay? What? Girl. Okay. Why is she full coverage? Why is she full coverage? Wow. Really? But um, obviously this is not my shade. But I do got to say, I give it to them with the concealer. They did that. They did that. They really did that. I'm going to go ahead and just blend out this foundation. Get it on that neck, honey. I just wish that my concealer, this shade, the foundation actually worked pretty good too. Okay, we got her blended. I definitely give these two 10 out of 10. For the 99 cent store, they did their job. I just gotta see if it creases, but overall full coverage, they really meant full coverage. They really had like a, a little variety of shades. Next, this bronzer stick creates a healthy looking bronze glow. Creamy formula is ultra blendable and buildable. Okay. I said it again. By the way, these are all Pearl World um, brands that I've been using. This almost looks like red. I'm so sorry about that freaking leaf blower. You guys can't see it, but in real life, it looks red. Hmm. I wonder if it shows up like how it does in person. I don't think so. I'm just gonna try to blend it out, guys. It looks more like a blush. That's so crazy. I wish you could see it. It's actually not too bad at blending, but I wish you guys could see the color. It looks like a blush in person. I'm gonna have to pass on this bronzer stick only because the shade is pretty blendable. I'm gonna give them that. But the only thing is, is like, this really isn't a bronzer. This is like more of a blush. And I know it probably doesn't make sense because you're probably like, girl, that foundation and concealer isn't your shade. At least it's kind of close to what a shade is. You know, this just doesn't make sense to me. So far, our foundation and everything is looking pretty good good still i'll give them that okay i'm not gonna lie i was pretty skeptical of using their foundation and stuff but i had high hopes for that concealer and they both did pretty good next we have this ultimate bronzer and it's a sun-kissed glow buildable and smooth powder Dang, she's pretty big. They said, okay, you get your money's worth for 99 cents. I just realized I don't have like a powder for my face. We're just gonna finish the whole makeup look and hope for the best. She is pigmented. She is pigmented, y'all. They did not come to play with this one. Why did they pop off with some of these products though? I'm actually like impressed. Good color, good everything. I gotta bronze the hell out of this nine head of mine. So give me a second, it might take like 10 hours. I am impressed. Did her thing, you guys, she really did her thing. <laughs> Why did she do it to them like that, what? I love this. I'm gonna add it to my everyday makeup. This is a cop. A straight up cop. This or this, this, this. Okay, period. I'm gonna do my little nose contour now. So I did my little one-two on my nose contour and she came out cute. I am a little oily, a little greasy, but I know if I had gotten like some type of setting powder or something, it would have held its weight. I would hope that it would be a good one. But at the end, I might just use my own, but I just want you guys to see everything before I go ahead and do that but it's actually like really good I'm not creasing or anything 
she's doing her big one. I love her. We have this blush, blush and powder brush. Buildable, ultra blendable, long lasting color, instant pop of color to your cheeks. And it says it's in the color rosy. So far, I've only used um, Pearl World and Ayani. I'm gonna give her a little go. Look at how pretty this is though. They're cute. Um, hello? Hello? Maybe it's just the best. Okay, it was just the brush. Dang, that girl is popping. In person, it looks more pink, you guys, I swear. Oh, she is like a highlighter and blush in one. Cute. Smells pretty good too. A blush actually works, but with your own brush, it's just very um, highlighting, and I'm not used to the highlight type of thing. And I think if I had like some powder on, it would look better to me. I just feel kind of like glossy right now. We're gonna go in with this mascara, False Lash Effect Mascara. It says biotin infused. That's really good. Extreme volume, ultra buildable, and long lasting. Hey, our face is looking good. 99 cent store. Who? This is such cute packaging. They did that. This is also the Pearl World. <laughs> gonna make sure she's on there. We have a good wand. I'm gonna go ahead and coat my lashes. First impressions. Okay, she did that. What? Hold the phone. I'm liking her. She is cute. Some don't do anything. This did something. I just got a birthday gift from Sephora and it was a mascara. I don't remember the brand it was, but this did way more than that one already. I, I'm, I'm a fan of her. I'm just going to go ahead and do the other off camera and then we're going to come back for falsies. I just sneezed. Like I was saying at the beginning of this video, if you know, you know, Ayani has a lot of lashes that everyone is going crazy for. I literally got some just so I could have for other than the sake of the video. I'm going to show you guys some of the ones that I did get. First of all, I was really shocked to see that they have half lashes. How cute are those? I'm definitely going to be using one of these today just because I want to see how they look. And then I got these. Super, super cute. I love the spikes in this one. And I just love how full these ones are. But we're gonna save these for another day. I think I'm gonna try out the Pisces. Halfling lashes. Wispy natural baby foxy crisscross. I'm gonna be using my own lash glue because I didn't see one. I know that they had one. I know they had one. Also, they had these tweezers. They're lash tweezers. I had to get some. I'm excited. Uh, they're a little blue color. Look at my tweezers, okay. She's cute. I'm not used to half lashes, but I actually like it. I like them. I feel like I have little butterfly wings on my eyes. And then obviously if you want like a dramatic effect, they have that available. I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the lip that I got. I got this liquid lipstick. Well, they had a lot of options, but I actually just kind of wanted to see how this would look. Oh, so it does say it's matte finish. I don't wear matte lipsticks, but it was red and I don't have any red lipsticks by Ayani too. Oh, she's a pretty red. I'm excited because what if I use this for Christmas? Let's get into it! Let's get into it! <laughs> I know I'm annoying, but anyways. Okay. Why the fuck does she smell so good? <laughs> she smells so good, I want to eat her for real. It doesn't dry before you could draw it on. I like her though. Look at that color. Hello. I think I'm going to wear her for Christmas. For 99 cents. <laughs> okay, girl. This lipstick got me hyped up. I don't know why. Can we get a round of applause? Please? Without powder to take that into consideration. I really think that the 99 fucking popped the fuck off with this. And also with this lipstick, it's super, super cute. I love it. I'm going to be using it. Just don't like. Oh, I fucked it up. That's for me fucking around. 
The only thing that really didn't do it for me is this cream bronzer. Everything else I think popped off personally. Yeah, this concealer was really, really good. The bronzer powder was really good. The blush is cute. She's just giving highlighter too. I went ahead and I said it. I think that she's gonna be perfect. No one's even gonna know I used the 99 cent store. I definitely would recommend, especially the lashes. Like, girl, look how cute they are. Overall, we put all of the products together. I only spent $9 on this look. Okay, bargainer. If you guys want to see me do the Dollar Tree makeup, if you want to see me do any other types of makeup, try anything else out, give you guys products I love, give you products I hate, let me know. I'll be sure to do them. I will have so much fun. This was so much fun. Don't forget to subscribe, like this video, share it with your friends, leave a comment, and let me know what you guys want to see next. Like, really, I will really do it. Happy holidays. Be a baddie on a budget. Per, she did that. Bye.